Hi guys, welcome back for another video. My name is Emily. If you are new here, thank you for clicking on my video. Don't forget to also click that like and subscribe button. Um, today I did a bunch of, I actually did a TikTok of chopping a bunch of plants. So I was just gonna give you guys a propagation box video. So I removed everything that like has roots and is ready to be planted to dirt, like this one here. Um, and I'll do that after. Um, but if you haven't watched last time's propagation box video, go check that out and it'll show you what was in it before. Um, so this time I have everything pretty much cut except for one massive plant, which I want to chop up. So um, if you hear weird noises, my landlords are doing construction next door. It's great. Um, so first up is this, this is actually a Syngonium elbow cutting but as you can see there's no variegation on either of these leaves there's a new leaf coming so I chopped it back to where the last variegated leaf was and I'm hoping that it will then produce variegation again which would be great um I actually might just chop this one more time here and then just do a wet stick cutting because like why not um the cat's here if you cannot see him he's right there and he likes to try to swat at the plants so I'll just cut that there. And then I'm just gonna do a wet stick for that one. Um, yeah, so that's gonna go in the box first. All the way to the bottom, so it can root in there. Um, I did a chopped up this, oh no, which one is this? not the exotica it's the silvery ann um syndapsis so i cut this because it was uh getting a little laggy and then it had also skipped some nodes so i'm going to cu cut those nodes first and again wet sticks are like one of my favorite things i just have like a mini prop box all full of wet sticks and then i forget what i put in there and it just uh Oh, there's no note on that one. Um, so then I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna cut them all actually. So cut there, cut that stick a little shorter. Cut here. Uh, oh, there's a missed node in between, so we're gonna do another wet stick. Cut in between. Cut, cut so many cuttings when you're doing this it's so funny and then we'll do some wet sticks so there's wet stick there and one here um this one doesn't actually have a node on it yet so i'm gonna actually leave this as a full cutting so all of these are gonna go in here um i also have um I can't remember what this is called. It's that plant in my bathroom, but it skipped nodes again. So I keep cutting it back until it's gonna give me some good nodes. Um, and this one doesn't look like, I don't know if that one has a thingy on it. I'm just gonna stick it in there just as is and see if it grows anything. Oops. All the way down to the bottom. Um, I also have my Skindapsis, or Skindapsis, uh, Monstera Silta Pecan, super pretty. So I had done a cutting there and then it skipped a bunch of nodes. So I was like, then eh, we're just gonna keep cutting it. Um, this is one of my favorite plants, honestly. It is, it is such a forgiving plant. Um, it is always so happy. I actually just moved it too from out of my bathroom into my main area of plants um i will i'm gonna film a plant tour video after this so if you want to see next week will be a plant tour video because i have moved a ton of stuff around um because of little miss here who's hiding behind me um so i moved a bunch of stuff around just so she can't potentially get into any plants because there's a ton of plants that are actually poisonous to dogs right and cats, but my cat doesn't touch the plants. Um, we're gonna do a bunch of wet sticks of this because I just honestly, I love wet sticks. Like, I, I, that might be weird. 
but like it's so much fun throwing a whole bunch in a bin and then they start to go and you're like uh what was this again <laughs> and the end doesn't have oh that might be we'll throw it in there anyways just in case so there's only like actually four leaf cuttings that we're gonna stick in our prop box the rest are wet sticks. I'll show you my wet stick box after. I actually haven't looked at my wet stick box in, I don't even know when. I don't know the last time I looked at my wet stick box. Um, so the other one I wanted to show you is what, so when I went to, hey, no, he's attacking. Don't bite, Biggie. Um, when I went to this plant store, um, I did the haul video right there. Um, I got a cutting from my friend of what we believe is, might be a Hawaiian pothos. That's there, look how like yellow the um, stems are. So I had one big long cutting from it and it's rooted so well in water. So I'm actually gonna leave that main rooting in there and I'm gonna stick all these extra ones in there as well. I will top the water up on this. Um, and then hopefully this will make like a super full pot of it. And I'd like to put this pot in my bathroom. I will show you in next week's video where I think it will go. But yeah, the stems are super cute. They're so yellow. So hopefully this will root good and yeah, that's about it. Um, and then I'm gonna take you over here cause I wanna show you this other plant. <laughs> okay, I have to lean over, but I, loved this plant. This is the Monstera adinsonii when I first got it. Um, and then it went super, super bare on top. So I kept throwing cuttings in, throwing cuttings in. They're just, it's just not turning out how I want it to. So what I want to do is I'm going to cut the whole thing up and then propagate all of it. Um, I have some friends that want cuttings because like, um, this one, Hey Biggie, no, this one, Hey Biggie, this one just, it just keeps keeps going um, and it keeps going and it's I should I should really measure it and sh like to tell you how long it is but I want to chop this whole thing up so I'm going to put you on the floor and then we're gonna like super zoom this super zoom I don't know if that's the right word okay I'm gonna tilt you down you see down here? Okay, I'm gonna fast forward you so we can do this all together. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna bore you by putting all of those cuttings <laughs> in the propagation box, but this is just what I use for my wet sticks. So it's just like, this was a um, container for ramen. Um, so I, these are the, all the ones from the Adansonia. So literally all I do is I just kind of sprinkle them in here. <laughs> and then all of the extras, I'm just gonna also just kind of sprinkle them in there. If they take, they take. If they don't, they don't. Um, and then it will end up turning out that I will have a bunch of plants that I have no idea if they, uh, if they'll go or not. So I just have a little lid and I just put the lid on and then that is it. And that's pretty much all I do. Oh, I missed a few. That lid needs a wash too, actually. Um, but yeah, they just kind of live in here and I just always hope that they will root. And yeah, we'll see. Um, but that's, I think, all I have for you guys today. So thank you so much for watching another one of my videos. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you made it all the, way to, went all the way to the end, leave me a little scissors emoji or knife emoji, something along those lines. <laughs> um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Oh, do you want to see the cat first? Biggie. Biggie. Come here, what's this? Come see. 
Vicky doesn't want to be on camera, but you saw Asha, so that's that's good. <laughs> Bye.